Gorilla Monsoon here at ringside with my colleague Jesse the Body Ventura. That's right, Gorilla. I'm pumped up. I'm here to call it like it is, as Jesse the Body always does. A tremendous happening right here. You won't find any better action anymore. Well, I'll tell you what, Gorilla, I'm pumped up. I'm happy to be a part of it. It's great to be back with you. It's my pleasure to be here with you and part of this happening. Unbelievable. Here we go. Time for talk is ended. Absolutely. They're ready. They've trained hard. What a matchup this is going to be, Gorilla Monsoon. Unbelievable ovation as they're hanging off the rafters. Just take a look at the fantastic spillover crowd here for this extravaganza. The World Wrestling Federation outdoing itself and presenting this unbelievable part of wrestling. One. Holy I'm, I'm so Two. excited, Jess. You can, you can feel the electricity in the air here. You can Four. grab a hold of it, touch it, cut it. That's right. It's everything I expected it to be, Gino Monsoon. Boy, you said that right, Jesse. And this is just an international affair. We're just deluged here by cameramen and newspaper reporters from all over the entire world wanting to cover this event. Boy, it's a happen. Well, this is going to be a classic matchup. One. You're going to see some tremendous moves in this bout. Speed, Three. agility, knowledge, it's all in there. All the ingredients necessary for a great match. This will separate the men from the boys right here. Well, Gorilla, you can feel the tension right now. This is what it's all come down to. You can cut it with a knife. You can feel the electricity in the air. You're going to see some fine wrestling here. Absolutely. Take a look at the charisma. Take a look at the power pack. Oh, definitely. They're both in great shape. Great shape. I got to do my normal. Say hi to my four biggest fans in Minneapolis. Terry Tyrell, James Jeremiah. What are you talking about? I don't know. I never heard you say hello to anybody else before. They're a long way from home, Here. It's going to be a classic confrontation here. 
You got two veteran wrestlers. They, these two guys also dress are the type of guys who, if necessary, could wrestle for an hour and a half. Definitely. I'll tell you, these are like two big Mack trucks colliding head on. The irresistible force meeting the immovable object. And both of these guys will be pulling out all the stops. You can bet on that one. Can you imagine just what's going through the mind? One, two, two, three, two, three. Well, how would you like to be that little referee having to try to contain these two guys? Well, that's where you use the count, Jess. You don't try to physically step between these guys, but you can squash like a great. I like to take my time, too. It's a psych out thing, that is Gorilla Monsoon. It's a psych out. You get your opponent, you get him upset. Just those little added leg edges can mean the difference between victory or defeat. Very, very important part of professional wrestling is psychology, and no one knows it any better than my colleague. Very well put, Jesse. Well, it's important the pace of a man. Some guys like a slower pace, other guys like a faster pace. And if you can get your opponent to wrestle at the pace you want to go at, that's to your advantage at all times. You know that as well as well, I do, Gino. My, my key was never play another man's game, Jess. That's right. You know, make him play your game if at all possible. Don't play his, and if you can't get either one, then just wing it. That's right. He saw battle going on here, Jess. Definitely a good, good matchup. How quick the momentum can change in professional wrestling with the tight time, so to speak. If you don't have a face of wrestling talent, forget about it. That's right, that's right. Unless possibly you're an awesome individual like a King Kong Bundy. Well, I understand that he also has to be a you got That makes it doubly bad. Okay. Doubly bad. It's like having dynamite with a short fuse. Some damage done to that uh, 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 hamstring in there, hamstring muscle, muscle or whatever. Sure, it happens all the time. Plenty of injuries. That's what I talked about. I, I thought it was a stupid move. Well, I, I disagree with you then, and I disagree with you now. Yeah, well, I'm looking. Apparently, he's injured himself. It happens all the time. Just goes with the territory. I understand somebody's in jeopardy of you losing your yacht, Jess. Is that correct? Yeah. Yeah, one of your millionaire friends, I don't know. Not Marv. Oh, no. I didn't say it. Did I? Oh. I know you like to rub elbows with those guys. No, 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 no. They like to rub elbows oh. with me, Marv. Find out all the Hollywood dots. Sure. sure. I was on the plane the other day with Farrah Fawcett. Sure. Couldn't keep her away from me. Had to call the stewardesses for help. Quick use. Substantial. Certainly. Ryan O'Neill saw the whole thing. I Had a chance to see Mr. Perfect's father, Larry the Axe, hitting. Yes, I know. Still got a 24-inch neck. He said he had to lose 20 pounds. I said, get your neck down to 18, you'll lose it. Oh, one of the big fans, Jess, of the WWF. Yep, Sugar Ray and Leonard. I guess you'd call him the undisputed middleweight champ now, right? I'd dispute it, though, because I think Marvin Hagler won. Well, you have enough undisputed things to claim, Jess. Bob Euchre was here last year. What a guy. Well, I won't talk so good about Bob Euchre. To me, he ain't such a great guy. How about Vanna White, then? Well, I keep hush on Vanna. Oh, Bobby, welcome! All right. Hey, this is it, man. This is the first time I ever had an option renewed. Second year for me, Gorilla. Glad to have you back, Bobby. Well, I guess it's okay. You know, like they said, they renewed your contract. Like you said, you never got that in baseball, Euchre. One year with each team there. I'm looking forward to it, man. Good to be back with you and you. I'm going to have trouble, I can tell, here at City Beach hey. The youth and the body. I don't think Vanna White has to worry about getting chased around by these two. She's having a good time eluding Mr. Baseball. Oh, she's definitely here, you. Yeah, I'm supposed to be here. That's the oh, main reason for being here. here. That's your main reason for being yeah, here. Yeah, yeah. Vanna White? Yeah. I'm supposed to meet her here someplace. Well, you, do you, you have any idea that she's in love with me? Uh, I, I saw something about that in some tablet. I bet, no, that's not her. It was, uh, in fact, the National Examiner, you. Is I'm that where it was? Page, yes. She wouldn't come here unless she got a date from me. And I was very upset about that. Jack Tunney never asked me. <laughs> I'm sure, I'm Woo! sure you're aware, you, that the body is uh, going to be behind the broadcast. Yes, I know that. I'm...